tricks with your uh, application. You have gesture control, and you get. Uh, <coughs> Uh, ignore that thing about the second taste of the So this is a small sensors example from Cube Mobility. Uh, it's available in 1.0 and you can use it on MIMO and soon via the Spark Store on Simeon as well. Uh, it's a suite of uh, uh, maybe five high level sort of sensors to let you think, do things like uh, magnetic compass, uh, digital compass, uh, accelerometer support, um, and sort of some high level sensors that sort of process that data and give you things like orientation, which is what side is up, what side is down, uh, what's the ambient light level if you uh, want to adjust the brightness of your screen or the gamma or anything like that. Um, also perhaps to detect whether the phone's up to somebody's face or not. Uh, anyway, the sensors API, uh, I'll show you this demo and then I'll show you another demo and then I'll have a look at some of the code. As you can see, in this case, uh, it's a free fall trigger. Uh, basically, you start the timer, it will detect when you drop it and tell you uh, how far it fell. <laughs> As you can see, it fell about 82 centimeters. Uh, he actually dropped it at 100? Obviously, <laughs> you may want to try and catch it. He doesn't throw it up, but. <coughs> I wouldn't do that yet. <laughs> um, here we have another part of the demo. It shows you the uh, acceleration. So if you shake it around, you get some really big numbers there. This is sort of the raw data. It's not filtered very well. Um, that's why there are some more higher level sensors. For example, this orientation sensor. So as you can see, this says it's up. It's face up. Um, upside down, face down, top down, top up left up, etc. You can see the values there, that the, uh, the orientation, the, the x, y, and z values. Z1 doesn't change. So that's the uh, simple census demonstration. Uh, you can probably think of various ways to use this. Uh, gestures like silence the alarm, um, go away, you know, uh, I'm bored, ring me, get me out of this meeting, that type of thing. So <coughs> here's a demo that may set off, but uh, should be interesting nonetheless. It's a combination of digital uh, compass and um, orientation sensing. Uh, you can sort of, as you tilt the device, it uh, changes the view. And I think you see a picture of Sunny Tampara. And again, that's using sensors and uh, read graphics view in that case. Uh, I can show you the uh, code of that uh, small screen sensors demonstration just as a, a quick overview. But I'll also, before I do that, show you the documentation for the sensors module. So this is Qt Creator, part of Noki Qt SDK, and uh, an excellent way to browse your documentation and write your code. So this is the documentation for the census module. At its basic, uh, at its basic there's a base class for uh, an abstract sensor. Uh, you get a re an abstract reading from an abstract sensor. And there are a number of subclasses to provide the various things like magnetometer, accelerometer, orientation sensor, all that type of thing. Um, again, of course, there's examples in the source code. Uh, there's tap sensors. So Tap it on the top, tap it on the bottom, that type of thing. The way that it uh, it works, you create the device, you tell it to start, or you tell it to stop. Once you start it, is when it obviously starts giving you readings. Uh, you might not want to start it all the time if you want to perhaps conserve some battery life, that type of thing. Uh, readings are delivered in two ways. One is via a signal that's emitted when a signal is ready. If you want more direct access, you can also install what's called a filter. And that's basically a callback that's called, delivers your new readings to it, and you can use it there. And that's what, uh, for example, the free fall part of the demo uses. Uh, as you see, all the documentation may not be as readable here as it could be, but it's all on the, the doc.qt.noki.com website, and it's also available within Qt Creator and the Noki Qt SDK. 
So I'll have a look at the uh, small sensor, small screen sensors demo. Uh, that's not it. That's also not it. So here's the start of the pre-four part of the demo. Uh, creates an acceleration sensor. 